So I teach Jake here and I'm here to bring you another video. Well, today I wanted to talk to you guys about this app that I always use because it's so good. Um, I know the new iPhones have this feature called continuity where you can get all your notifications straight to your phone um, and text messages, phone calls, things of that sort all sent straight to your phone well I was kinda jealous of that so um, I found an app for Android that does that and when I first started using it it was only available for the Chrome browser but for some reason I find myself using Safari now so it recently became available for Safari so I'm gonna kinda tell you guys how to get it and what it does. Um the app is called Push Bullet and it's in the Android App Store, the Play Store. So the first thing you wanna do is go to the Play Store. And let's type in push foot. And here it is right here. It's a free app. So I already installed it, but this is what it looks like. And once you install it, it looks like this um, and you could sign in through Google Plus or Facebook or I think you could create a account with your email but once you get that all set up then it comes to this and instead of like sending emails to yourself like when you want to email yourself you can um, like if you have stuff on your phone you want to send to yourself you kind of create what they call pushes and you put the information in a certain area for your phone and it pushes it to your computer so you'll get a notification that pops up it says you have this file and you can click on it and see what it is and go from there but because I always tend to get real busy on the computer and leave my phone in another room or somewhere that's not close to me it's good because I'll be working and I'll see like a text message pop up and I'm like oh this person texts me and it'll let me reply to the text right there so I don't have to like grab my phone the only thing I don't like that I wish they were built into this app is the fact that you can't call from it but I have another way to do that but I'm going to show you in another video but back to push bullet so you have this and it has the pushes you can add um, friends to it or it has like this little blog section that you can join and get the latest tech news or you um, in order to get your notification sent to your computer your PC or your Mac you have to make sure that notification forwarding is on and then in your settings um, you could even either have your normal notification sound for your text message um, when it comes through or um, you can have them only sent while you're on a Wi-Fi connection or it lets you pick what apps you want notifications for as you can see it says um, text messages right now but 
all these apps are available any app you have on your phone if you get push notifications for it it'll pop up and let you know that you have a notification whether it's email or whatever it may be there's a notification that can pop up for it so I'm gonna show you exactly how this works so I have a separate Google Voice number for my business so that's what I'm gonna use to text myself So I have the hangout styler set up and that's what I use with my Google Voice number. And I'm gonna send myself a text message. So I'm gonna say how are you? You guys before I send that and show you I forgot the main thing um, in order to really get these um, sent through the correct way you have to pick um, when you create your account you go to pushbullet.com like this Go to pushbullet.com and create your account. Like I said, you can either log in with Facebook, Google Plus, or a regular email. And you pick the browser. Whatever browser is open, that's the one it connects to. Or in my case, I have two because I used to use it on Chrome and now I use it on Safari. And this is the name of my phone down here. And because I set it up already, it says everything looks good. You click this button and download the app, which is the app I showed you in the Google Play Store. And then the second step is to click here and get the extension. And once the extension downloads, it downloads over here. And you click it and you see it says push bullet and you click on it and it goes into your extensions which show up in here in your Safari extensions or Google extensions oops I'm sorry guys um, that's the get new extensions you go into your preferences and you click on extensions and there's your push bullet extension and it says uninstall enable on off so make sure that the enable button is checked and the on off is checked and you're all set so back to what I was telling you So then I send my text message and um, and there goes my text. And it says the virtual IT chick message um, push bullet, and it says, "How are you doing?" Um, just because I'm now realizing that it comes up super fast and doesn't give you the um, option to reply, I'm gonna show you how it works in Chrome. Because now seeing that, it actually does work better in Chrome. So I'm going to show you how that works really quick. So 
So even if your chrome is not all the way up, as long as it's working, you should be good. So So my chrome is open and if I send another text and it sends and there it goes and it says reply and I can say from my MacBook, I can say, how are you? And enter, and it should show up in my, how are you? So I hope this is useful for you guys, because it's like a lifesaver for me. Because I know sometimes I tend to leave my phone in like, the kitchen or something and then I'll come in here and start working on something and then my mom will be like oh I text you or people will call me and be like oh how come you didn't answer and it's like because I didn't see that you called but with this it'll notify you that somebody is calling but you can't actually answer it and I'm going to tell you what I use to do that with in my next video so I hope you guys um, like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope this video was useful for you. This has been your girl, the Virtual ID Chicks. See you next time.